We've had a beautiful tomato crop this year and we finally found a trellising system that we really like. In the past, we have tried staking our tomatoes, we have tried tomato cages, we have tried string weaving our, our tomatoes, but it seems like they always go over and sprawl on the ground. Sprawling on the ground makes it difficult to water them, makes it difficult to harvest them, and there's also the disease problem because you don't get good airflow around the leaves. But if you look at this system, we have tomato vines that are almost six feet tall. Here's a tomato vine over here that's taller than I am, and I'm six foot four. So let me explain how we did this system. We first put in four metal T posts on three to four foot centers. And then we attached welded wire fencing to these T posts. The wire in this fencing is two inches by four inches on center and this fencing is five feet tall. We then dug a furrow at the bottom of the fencing. That's so that we could use a hose to water the plants. We planted the tomatoes on normal spacings and as these tomatoes started to grow we simply came in every few days and tucked the vines up into the vents fencing so they would start growing into the fencing. And you'll see now that they're attached to that fencing very solid and they're not going anywhere. So we have a beautiful tomato crop here. Look at these tomatoes here. Just a beautiful crop. Here's a nice tomato that I'm going to, to uh, pick here for supper tonight. Just a beautiful tomato. Now another thing we like about this system is that this winter, when these vines are dead and br brittle, I'm going to come in and I'm going to clean them off of the fence. Then in the springtime, in the summer, we're going to come in and we're going to plant our peas, or we're, we can plant our pole beans, or we can plant our cucumbers, or there's several different garden crops that we can plant up against this trellising and they will grow into the trellis just like these tomatoes have and they will have the same benefits of this. So we're going to put in more of these trellises around the garden. We're going to start developing a vertical garden where all of our plants grow up towards the sun and the air. And um, so we think this is going to be a big, a nice benefit to our garden.